hello viewers in today's uh, class we are going to take up an integration involving greatest integer function so here we have this integral and we have to integrate uh, this greatest integer x minus 1 over 2 from 1 to 5 so here uh, let us call this integral as i and here we have the limits from x is equal to 1 to x equal to 5 right so here we see that uh, uh, x it belongs to uh, the interval uh, 1 to 5 so therefore uh, we see that uh, the value of uh, x minus 1 over 2 uh, it belongs to uh, 0 comma 2 right how because uh, when x is uh, 1 then the value of x minus 1 over 2 is 1 minus 1 over 2 that is 0 over 2 that is 0 and when x is uh, 5 then we have uh, x minus 1 over 2 is equal to 5 minus 1 over 2 that is 4 over 2 that is 2 so when x varies from 1 to 5 then x minus 1 over 2 it varies from 0 to 2 right okay so now uh, here if we express uh, this interval on the number line here we have 0 here we have 2 so the integer which lies between 0 and 2 is 1 right so x minus 1 over 2 uh, it varies from 0 to 1 then we have from 1 to 2 and uh, now we'll express uh, this uh, greatest integer function that is x minus 1 over 2 as a piecewise function so we'll split this function and when uh, x minus 1 over 2 it lies uh, between 0 and 1 right when x minus 1 over 2 it lies between 0 and 1 then the value of this greatest integer x minus 1 over 2 is 0 right and when uh, x minus 1 over 2 it lies between 1 and 2 x minus 1 over 2 it lies between 1 and 2 then the value of the greatest integer x minus 1 over 2 is 1 right so let us take an example suppose uh, here we have uh, 0 point say 4 so when uh, x minus 1 over 2 is 0 point 4 then the value of uh, greatest integer x minus 1 over 2 is greatest integer uh, less than or equal to 0 point 4 uh, which is 0 so here we have 0 right similarly for other values now if we have any other value between 1 and 2 say here we have 1.8 then uh, x minus 1 over 2 is uh, 1.8 uh, in that case the value of the greatest integer x minus 1 over 2 is 1.8 8 so this is greatest integer less than or equal to 1.8 so this is 1 right so here we have 1 right okay so uh, the value of uh, this greatest integer uh, x minus 1 over 2 is expressed like this now uh, our next aim is to solve uh, these uh, two inequalities uh, for x it means uh, we have to express uh, this inequality as an interval uh, in which x belongs to right so let us take the first one so we have here 0 less than or equal to x minus 1 over 2 less than 1 now multiplying throughout by 2 we have 0 here we have x minus 1 here we have 2 and adding 1 throughout we have 1 here here we have x and here we have uh, 2 plus 1 that is 3 so it means that when x minus 1 
over 2 it lies between 0 and 1 then x it lies between 1 and 3 similarly uh, let us solve uh, this one so here we have 1 less than or equal to x minus 1 over 2 here we have 2 now multiplying throughout by 2 we have 2 here here we have x minus 1 here we have 4 right now adding throughout 1 here we have 3 and uh, here we have x and here we have uh, 4 plus 1 5 right so it means uh, this uh, inequality uh, that is x minus 1 over 2 it lies between 1 and 2 so uh, x lies between uh, 3 and 5 right so here we have 1 and here we have 5 so here we have 1 and here we have 5 clear so now viewers uh, uh, this uh, greatest integer uh, function x minus 1 over 2 uh, can be expressed as 0 uh, when x uh, is greater than or equal to 1 uh, but less than 3 and this is equal to 1 uh, when x is greater than or equal to 3 but less than 5 right okay now uh, come to the integral so here we have i and now we can uh, split this integral uh, into two integrals one from 1 to 3 and other is from 3 to 5 so we have two integrals i1 and i2 now, i1 is uh, from 1 to uh, 3 so here we have 1 to 3 and uh, we have the function here and uh, i2 is from 3 to 5 3 to 5 so here we have 3 to 5 and the greatest integer x minus 1 over 2 dx right okay now i is uh, now i can be written as uh, 1 2 3 and the value of uh, this function right this function is 0 when x lies between uh, 1 and 3 and uh, here we have 3 to 5 and the value of this function is 1 so here we have 1 dx now the value of this integral is 0 here we have x the integral of uh, dx is x and the limits are from 3 to 5 right so we can now uh, simplify this 5 minus 3 that is 2 so therefore uh, the value of uh, uh, this integral is uh, 2